Hey YouTube, it's Teddy again. Um, we're here in my bedroom with only four small snakes left. All the others have moved out into the larger snake room in the shed. So we'll just go through these piece by piece. First off we have the female Abino Labyrinth Burmies. Um, she's still exceptionally nice looking. Still a little small. She's a great eater though, so she should be big anytime soon. Next, we have the male snow corn snake. See him there next to the ex terra hide. Size comparison, he's about three and a half feet long. He's doing well. See, he's kind of moving now today's feeding day, so that one might be a bit antsy. So that's him. Next we have the male Jumeril's boa, who I think is in shed right now. Yeah, he's in shed, just he's looking a little dark there. But uh, that's him. He's getting big for his hide. Next we have in this condensed bin, boa constrictor. See, so she's overdone her water bowl there and this is one of the pair and the male has unfortunately passed on since so I'm right now thinking of selling on this female but I know I kind of want to keep her she's nice very aberrant there you can see almost kind of jungle markings there you can see on her tail there is no red whatsoever P a possible marker of a uh, het melanism her mother was a melanistic boa that's also where the aberrancy might come from there. She's a female. You can see her size there. Especially this 50 litre tub. Really useful box. It's about, I think, 16 inches wide. Um, so, yeah, that's her. I'm also selling the male jumerals there. So, if anybody from Ireland has an offer, they can private message me. Anybody from England as well, if, if uh, we could work out something to deliver them by. Um, sorry anybody from outside that was interested in them they're a little far from me that's the June was there again that's for sale also there that's him this is actually her paperwork Sorry, can't really focus in on that. But it uh, says um, additional information on this is from extremely dark female, um, possible melanistic. So that could be something genetic for people who want to work on something genetic like that. If you want to cross it into albino, make very white albino. If you want to cross it into anery, make very dark aneries, you know. That could be a cool project for someone, but uh, right now it's not a good time for me to do that, so I'm thinking of maybe selling around. Male Jumerals, same story. Um, he's a bit small to breed, and you know, I've got enough kind of stuff going on at the moment where I'm trying to breed Jumerals as well, and just kind of concentrate my berms and Taiwans. So that's for someone to contemplate if they want to buy those two snakes. Um, I'm doing a bunch of videos today, so and I'm going to put them up over the next couple of weeks, so you should see more from me. Sorry about the lull in videos. Alright, bye-bye.